And where do you think you're going, young lady? I'm going to watch my favorite TV show, Mommy. It's on right now, and I don't want to miss any of it. Please let me watch, Mommy. Please, please, please. Oh, no, you're not. I'm fed up with that junk you watch. Today, you're going to watch something nice and wholesome, like Uncle Arnold's household. Yeah. None of that. You're coming with me. Honestly, I don't know how you kids can watch that stuff. by humans and dissect. This is where they saw the UFO. So what? Everybody sees UFOs these days. Big deal. Come on, let's go. Hi, I'm an R-A-L-F. You got anything to eat? R-A-L-F? What's that? R-A-L-F. Rejected alien life form? Rejected? Well, we don't want any either. What do you want? I'm from another planet, and I'm all alone here. I have no place to live. I'm hungry. All right. You can stay in our garage tonight, but tomorrow you'll have to go. What about food? I'll check the fridge. You go to the garage and try not to make any noise. Reject? Where are you? I brought food. <gasps> What's this? A peanut butter sandwich. Where I'm from, we serve jelly with peanut butter. Oh, yeah? Where are you from? Right there. Pretty cute tomato, huh? George, what's going on? Katie, what are you doing up? I heard a noise. Who's that? That's Reject. He's from another planet. He's awful cute. Awful is right. I don't know about the cute part, though. Well, send him home and come to bed. Bed? That's little kid stuff. Come on, let's have some fun. Stop that. You'll wake the entire neighborhood. Come on, George, let's go to bed. Is that a dream or a nightmare? I don't know. Hi, what did you bring me for breakfast? <sighs> it wasn't a nightmare. It's real. Come on, let's go raid the fridge. Mom's not gonna like this. We've got to get rid of him. But how? On my planet, this is what we call a sandwich. If your planet's so great, why don't you go back there? Hey, relax! Earth food's not bad. There's just not much of it. What are you talking about? You just cleaned out the entire refrigerator. George and Katie, cutie. Uh-oh! What happened here? And who is that? Hi, Mom. This is Reject. He's from another planet. 
Hi there, cutie. That's Mrs. Cutie to you. Now get him out of here. I've got enough mouths to feed with you kids. What do we do with him? I don't know. Maybe scientists would want him. Hi, we're George and Katie Cutie, and we'd like to see the man in charge of UFOs. We have an alien, and we thought you people might be interested in him. I doubt it, but I'll ask. Hello, Dr. Brian. This is reception. There are two kids with an alien out here. They'd like to see you. Okay. Go right in. First door on the left. See, Reject? We'll get you home. I don't know. I'm beginning to like it here. So, you interested in our alien? Hmm. Not really. Aliens are a dime a dozen. Just like rocket scientists, huh, Doc? Quiet, Reject. He can help you. These days, everybody's seeing them. Don't you read trashy newspapers in supermarkets? Well, we can't keep him. He's eating us out of house and home. He's a real pain, and he complains about everything. Then call his parents and have them pick him up. They don't want him either. They told him not to call home. Well, there's nothing I can do for you. I've got more important stuff to do besides babysit an unwanted alien. Yeah, like perform brain surgery on yourself. Come on, Reject. Pearl, we'll figure out something else. Can we do it after lunch? I'm starving. Somehow we've got to get your mom to let you come home. Yeah, well, in the meantime, let's get something to eat. I'm hungry, and that was my last apple. Hey, what's that? That's a supermarket. You mean there's food inside? Wait, let's go in. Hey, give me back control of my bike. Relax and enjoy the ride. I know I will. Yum! Food made me thirsty. You can't eat the food till you pay for it. Stop them! Mm, that was great. Now let's head for the dessert section. I don't think we're gonna have time. Hey! Hey, you put back here! Herb, wake up! Huh? What's up? I don't know. Some mm. kind of disturbance. I think we better give chase. Oh, all right. If you insist. I think we're in trouble, Reject. You are in trouble? I'll give you trouble. See? Wow! This is great! Hmm. Green cheese. Not bad. Reject. I'm hungry. I don't think we're out of trouble yet. Give us our money. Who's going to pay for this food? I want to be paid now. Yeah. Yeah. I, I promise you'll all be paid somehow. Reject, we've got to get you home somehow. I can't go home. This is the fifth planet my folks have dumped me on in two months. Well, now it's an even six. Call your mom to come pick you up. All right. What's that? My heart phone. Every one of my planet has a direct line home. Hi, Mom. Can I come home now? Ah, oh, come on. There's almost no food left on this planet, and I'm starving. Great, thanks. What's for dinner? That again. Reject. I mean, terrific. When can you pick me up? Oh. Okay. Mom says I can come home, but she can't pick me up. She's got a bridge glove. How am I going to get home in time for dinner? I'm getting hungry again. Uh-oh. I'd recognize that stomach growl anywhere. They're in the garage. Get rid of it!
I'm sure you understand that we just can't send the rocket up any old time we want to. You'll send this one! Well, it looks like Reacher's gonna get home in time for dinner. I'm just glad we got rid of him before he ate the entire planet. Kids, do you need protection from bullies? Hey! That's my lunch! Not anymore! <laughs> what you need is the bully kicker! Hey! Don't be bothered by bullies again! I'm so scared! The bully kicker! A small step for kids, a large boot for bullies! And now it's time for a garbage pail groaner. Class? Class? Come to order. Who can tell us what we saw at the museum? Me, Mrs. Gallagher. I saw a mummy that was 3,000 years old. Oh, really? Well, whose mom was it? <laughs> My mom's not gonna like my report card. He got your report card, Elliot! Come back here! Come on, boy. Let me have that back. I've gotta have it to show my mom. She'll never believe a dog ate it. Come on, doggy. Nice, doggy. Hey, cut it out, boy! Down, down! <laughs> he likes you, Elliot. Yeah, you're a good old dog, aren't you? All right, boy, time to go home. Go on, scat! Is he still following us? Yep. It looks like you've got a dog, Elliot. Elliot? I'll see you tomorrow. I've got to go. Elliot, isn't today the day you bring home your report card? Ah, oh, gee. What happened to your report card, Elliot? A dog chewed it? Oh, I've heard some bad excuses, Elliot, but a dog chewed it takes the cake. What dog? This dog. He really followed me home from school. And he doesn't have a collar or anything, so he needs a home. Can I keep him, Mom? Can I? If you can't raise your English grade, you're going to be grounded. But what about Kenny? Can I keep him? But, Elliot, having a dog is not playing fetch and roll over. You have to feed him, walk him, bathe him. You'll never know he's here. Really? Put an ad in the paper. If no one claims him, we'll see. Yow! Get this dog out of my chair! Come here, Kenny. Get the bone. I'm sorry about dinner tonight, Harvey. I, I just don't know what happened to that recipe book. What are you doing on the floor? What am I? That? Oh, never mind. Ma, I thought dinner was terrific. So did Kenny. <laughs> See? Oh. Kenny? <laughs> Go get him, boy. <laughs> Look, Dad. Look what Kenny brought you. My slippers. My slippers. Sorry, Dad. He tried his best. Speaking of trying one's best, Elliot, shouldn't you be working on your book report? Yes, Mom. 
Come on, Kenny. Let's go to my room. Uh-uh. The doll goes outside for the night. And his bone, too. But you have to be very quiet so no one will know. What's going on? Shut that dog up! Go sleep below that racket! Somebody call the police! It's three in the morning! Did you get any sleep at all? Not after three in the morning. Elliot, eat your breakfast. But Mom, I don't have time. I'll be late for school. Elliot, you have a job to do. And have you fed Kenny yet? Gee, Mom, I really don't have any time this morning. Could you do it? Thanks. Bye. I'm warning you, Elliot. If you don't take care of this dog, he's gone. take turns keeping Kenny, then our parents won't mind as much. Great idea! Can I have him tonight? Oh, I sure hope I don't get into trouble with my mom. What can happen? It's only for a night. Look, I gotta get home. I got a book report due this week, and I haven't read the book yet. Have fun with Kenny tonight. What's going on in there? My face! And my plants! And my lamp! Gee, Mom, we were only playing. Well, play somewhere else. Like outside. Come on, Kenny, let's go. <laughs> Patty, I want that dog out of here. Well, it's my turn, Kenny. You'll be a good boy and behave, right? Who let that filthy dog into this house? Everybody else got to play with you. Me? I've got to give you a bath. Sheesh. Okay, in you go. Whoa! Now we're playing time. Dwayne! Dwayne? Didn't you see the water running over? Hey! Where do you think you're going, young man? Kenny! You're all wet, boy. What happened? Oh, well, whatever it is. You can stay here for the night, if you're quiet. Careful, Kenny. This is my book report. It's due tomorrow. I'm going to raise my grade two whole marks with this. 
time for school, Kenny, and I'm all ready. I've got my book report and... What happened? It's gone! Did you take it, Kenny? Did you eat it? Did you bury it? <laughs> Elliot? Kenny ran away from my house last night. I guess he just came back here. I'm glad he's okay. He won't be okay if I can't find my book report. <laughs> Kenny buried your book report? It's not funny, Dwayne. Without my book report, I'll flunk English. What's going on? Hey, my homework's in there. Grab him! No, wait. Let's follow him. Maybe he'll bury it in the same place he buried mine. There he is. Look at that! Everything's down there. My report, Mom's recipe book, Dad's paper. Elliot, what are you doing in my roses? It's the police! Oh, no. What did you do now, Kenny? Excuse me, are you Elliot Mess? He's not after Kenny. He's after you. Yes? <laughs> I'm sorry. I just had him a couple days, and I haven't been able to train him. He does this to everybody. Down, Mark Bark. Heel Boy. You know him? Sure do. The lost dog you advertised in the paper is Mark Bark, a valuable police dog. There's a hefty reward for it. Really? Absolutely. You can claim it at the station house. I'll claim it. And if there's anything left over after all the repairs, I'll make sure you get it. <laughs> now off to school. Thanks, Mom. Bye, Kenny. Mark, heel. Hey! Mark, Mark, come back here. Kenny, come back here with my book report. This is the party pooper. He can turn the best party into a storm. I hate parties. This is boring. To the party pooper is the party pooper scooper. <laughs> <laughs>